Hello everyone, today we are going to learn how to make a cubic box that you can use uh, for the bottom of the elephant box. So first you need a square piece of paper. If the paper has a white side, put it on the bottom and we'll fold the two diagonals. So one diagonal and we unfold, then the other one. And unfold. Turn the paper to the other side and we are going to take this edge and bring it to the center, center point and we are not going to mark the fold we will just make two pinches one small pinch at the bottom one small pinch at the top and we are going to repeat the same thing for the other sides the edge to the center, one pinch at the bottom, one pinch at the top, the third side, pinch, pinch, and one more, pinch, and pinch. Then we're going to take this edge and bring it to the pinch and this time we are marking the fold and we repeat the same thing for the other sides So this square here is going to be the bottom of our box. Then we're going to fold again this edge to the pinch, but to the first pinch that we made. So be careful to fold to the pinch and not to the fold. And we mark the fold. Unfold and repeat for the other sides. On the side, okay. Now we're going to fold back together the diagonals to form the walls, to form the sides of the box. So all four diagonals together. So we have four uh, tips inside. We are going to reverse the top of the tip like this. Reverse this fold, then reverse the middle fold and fold back. Like this, let me show you on a second one. So we reverse here. We reverse here as well and we fold back. Same thing for the other sides. Reverse, reverse, and fold back.
So put everything together again. And now we get to the tricky part of the box. We need to fold back all sides, the top of each side inside the box. So we have a fold marked here. We, we need to fold it back inside. And of course, it's a bit difficult because you have to do it for all sides roughly at the same time. Start with one side, then a second side. So don't worry if it looks a bit messy inside, it's not going to show. And one last side. Okay, it doesn't look very good, but what you can do then is just push back every fold inside so that they all come into place. And you can form your box like this. You have nice square sides. And your box is done. Thank you very much for watching this cube box video. In the next video, I will show you how to make an elephant lid so that you can turn your box into an elephant box. Having new subscribers encourages me a lot to make new models and to publish new videos, so please subscribe. Thank you very much and happy folding everyone!